what makes We Can Now unique in our approach is that uh, along with myself being the founder, the leadership behind We Can Now uh, has lived experience. It's a bunch of people in the community that are coming together to do something right now, hence the name We Can Now. Um, I grew up on like government assistance and things of that nature, so we had to kind of like wait for like food stamps, right? That, that drops on like a certain day. Uh, for us to get housing, we had to like stand in a line for hours and wait. And then once we got on the list, we had to wait for our housing to come through in order for us to be housed. And um, I wanted to just take a different approach, not blame anybody for the conditions that we've been in, even though there are uh, obstacles out there and, you know, utilize our own power and our own strength and our own brains and energy to be able to create the solutions and the things that we need with ourselves. We are a direct service provider, so everything that we do, we go directly to the people that we service and we give them the resources. We have our homeless uh, outreach program, which we go out every single Sunday. We've been doing so for three years. Um, we also have a youth program where we're focused on entrepreneurship and um, really getting in the community and transforming uh, youth who just don't have enough resources. We also have a family assistance program which we're out every Wednesday and we're going to like the housing projects around the city and we're providing uh, resources as well, financial literacy, groceries, paying bills, and just really helping them sustain. And then we're also in the process of building a felons program to help uh, felons once they get released from incarceration to come back and really have a good shot at getting back on the right foot and direction so they don't have to resort to the things that they did in the past. So when you're investing in We Can Now, you're investing in people, they're supporting programs, they're supporting a community that is um, rising up together to do for themselves. Um, they're supporting short-term solutions, long-term solutions, and ultimately sustainability for a group of people who've been underserved.